Heaven's California <laughs> Hello, it is Lego Brick Creations here with another Lego video. Now, a couple weeks ago, I posted a video on um, a demo video of the this machine here, which was Ski Ball. And in that video, I added text on the screen that said, I'll be doing a video of how this works. Now, what my plan is, is I'm going to be doing a new mini-series of machines that I make, and then I'll be making extra videos to go along with those Starting with Ski Ball and how they work, and then the demo video. So if you guys like stuff like this, maybe I'll conclude it. Also, in, uh, after this video today, also they'll be coming out with a haul. You guys can see it in the background. Also, I'll be doing a video on this play button for Lego Bird Creations. I'll just do a quick video on that. I also have a video sneak preview of this on my Instagram. You guys can figure out what that's out on my Instagram at Lego Bird Creations. But I'll do a video on that too. Um, but uh, yeah, let's get talking about this. So... If you guys haven't seen the demo video, I recommend you check it out. I'll just do a quick 360. I, I actually, this has been sitting there at my table since then. But without further ado, let's actually check of how this works. So how it works is if I take this off, pop this sucker off, it uh, removes this. Then it's just as easy as popping this off, and this comes off as one solid piece. Now we get into the symbol internals, which is very simple. So in the internals, we have the ball, uh, the place where it sits. This is where the ramp rests. And then we have a section over here. If I lift up and bring the this closer, this, this is actually a blockade. And when the balls fall into the loose hole, they go down this ramp into the ball compartment. Then in the... If they win zone, each ball will drop down and go through the ramp into the win zone. And they come out into here, of course. So if I show you guys that, look at the side, win. Oh. Here, I'll try to show it to you guys. So I haven't played with this machine in a while. So, alright, let's try it again. Sorry about that. Try it again, shall we? Okay, so if we I'll you know, show you at an angle. So you put this down the ramp, slides down, and sometimes if you have enough sometimes especially when you're playing ski ball, you should have a nice friction or bounce off. And it'll most likely come back down here. So you throw it up, bounces off, and gets back into the compartment down here. So that's pretty much it for this video. This can hold up the six balls in the compartment container. And then you just slide that back on. And uh, that's pretty much the internals of this machine. I told you guys it was very easy. If you guys want to build your own, it's very easy. I, uh, but, uh, I guarantee a bunch of you guys are wondering why I made this kind of uh, colorful. And in my retrospect, I thought I'd make it not one solid color. Um, I did match up colors perfectly. I made it kind of rainbow. I didn't like mash colors like crappily. You can see I went through time and effort to design this well. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it. This is the machine. It's pretty simple. It's a really easy mechanism. And uh, I finally made a ski ball game. I might take this on a camping trip. I'm debating. You know it's like oh, it might break. Stay, uh, but that's pretty much it. Stay tuned. In a couple weeks, I'll have a video, a demo video on this Lego miniature bowling alley with uh, secret, secret compartments where everything's stored. And a couple weeks after that, I'll have a video on this little miniature basketball game with two players. And in a couple weeks after that... I'll have a video on this minifig collection, which you'll figure out in that. And I'll be doing a video on this Lego play button soon, too. But until then, that's pretty much it, guys. Uh, also, this summer, I'm planning to have more Lego content than usual. I'll talk more when we get into the summer. I'm still going through my last few weeks of school. But I'll keep you guys updated on that. And until then, keep on building, and thanks for watching. And I'll see you guys in a few weeks. Bye.